I can. Sister with a testimony. And I'll tell you what, God has shown up as usual. And he has just done his thing. Holy Ghost, we praise you and we thank you. Sister with a testimony. Young man, you said your name was Jason. Yes, I know you know Justin and Karen. And you came over and you told us you had given up. You didn't, just didn't want to work, fight no more. And you basically just ready to just die. Um, it, we discovered the fact that you've cursed God. You shook his, your fist at him. You, you've just been all manner of just mad at God. Because you said he didn't answer your prayers. Yes, ma'am. Did he answer your prayers today? Um, 30 minutes ago, yes, he did. Ooh, what did he do? He um, changed my whole life around. What did you feel? Heart. What happened? I fell to the ground with the Holy Spirit. I feel, I feel a lot better right now. So you're you, you, you going to live now? I do live. I live by the Lord. Praise <laughs> <Thanks> God. <laughs> So a few minutes Woo! ago, a few minutes ago, you were cursing God. Yes, you said he didn't answer none of your prayers. He didn't listen to you. You're mad at him. Yes. You mad at him anymore? No. So tell us one more time when you come over to the car, what did you expect? I expected him, you know, not to answer me, but I realized he did have a plan for me in my heart. And I found my plan today. What's your plan? No, just never give up on Christ. Give his life day by day. Wow. No. So you're about to go out on us. What was going on in there? What, 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 how did you feel in your body? You couldn't stand up. I felt weak, but I feel strong now. <laughs> oh! Woo! Wow. That's the testimony right there. And uh, so are you glad you came over to say hey to Justin? Yes, I am. I'm glad you came. But see, hold on. Stand over there a little bit more, Justin. Jason, I want to tell you something, son. You came to the car. How could I let you leave the presence of the Lord God Almighty and go out there and die today? You couldn't. And I couldn't. Because you know why? I see a valuable soul, young man. I see a valuable soul. I see a smile. I see a good-looking young man. And I see two young men. That way a little bit, Justin. I see two young men right now that are saints with a testimony. Already 20 years old. How old are you, Justin? 20 and 21. I got two young men that can preach the gospel. They can go tell somebody what God just did for them. And what else did God do for you today, young man? He opened my eyes up. Ah. What are you going to do with your eyes now? Just wait for the right one to come find me. Okay. I'm not looking for the right girl. You know, okay. Every time I look, I end up getting hurt because the devil ends up getting in my way. So okay. why not just push him out of the way and wait for the right one to come towards me? Okay. God'll now, check you. this out, young man. The job. When you get a job and you're able to support yourself, you, I told you you were a soldier in God's army. You said you want to be a Marine. Yes, ma'am. Go be a Marine. I saw a job Monday anyways. I got an interview. All right. Praise, Praise the Lord. You're going to get that job. You too. see how he's answering your prayers, young man? Yes, ma'am. And Jason, if you will go and you'll get in a good Bible-believing church and you'll start reading the Bible, hold that Bible up we give you. It ain't much, but it's the Word of God. And I'll put it this way. It might Change be paperback, life, and most people say that ain't much. But let me tell you what. That Bible in your hand and you speaking it out of your mouth, Jason, will move the world. It will move mountains. It will move valleys. And it will change lives around you, son. If you will get in John, the book of John, and start reading about Jesus and start developing relationship with him. Now, I want you to pray for the people. As we go out, just speak what's in your heart. Um, I'm gonna, dear Holy Father, I thank y'all for all the turning that we have today. We wake up alive. I'm blessed to have all these people alive this morning. Let's live our day by day by Christ. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. I'm telling you, brother, Woo. you just start talking to the Lord, and He will give you the right woman. You got to worry about getting your life together first. If He's calling you to be a Marine. Go sign up and be a Marine. It's an ass bad. I'm worried about it. You ain't got to worry don't about worry. that. Don't You can do it. You need. It's mad. I'm struggling. Hey, don't hey, you ain't struggling with nothing no more. Say, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Here you, go. you know what I need? You sent me around, around the right people today. And you going to help me to remember? You going to help me to know things? You going to help me to pass the math test? And I'm going to be the best soldier. In your army. In Jesus' name. I love you, brother. My little brother Jason in the house. You try all the services. You don't do one, try the next one. There's four branches. All right. There's four branches. Justin, bless us as we leave.
Okay. Lord Jesus, I just pray for everybody all over America. I ask you to touch their hearts, forgive us for us. And, and Lord Jesus, I just pray for Justin Bieber. I ask you to touch his heart, give him peace, give him strength, give him joy, give him faithfulness, give him wisdom, give him knowledge. Wherever you're going through right now, I ask you to be with him. Everybody, Amen. Amen. Love you. God bless you. It's sister with a testimony in the field. Let's see that sister with a testimony. What is he? He said he got pain. He's a pain taker. He's a way maker. He's a healer. He's a deliverer. This is sister with a testimony in the field. You yeah, should be out it. here seeing the soul saved. In Jesus' name, we love you. God bless you. Later.